Hello and welcome back to another episode of XCOM 2 War of the Chosen. My name is Saiken and today we're continuing the Flawless Run where I am playing normal XCOM 2 War of the Chosen and am trying to do it without losing a soldier, a mission and matter of fact without trying to get hit at all. Today we're going to go into Operation New Chile, Operation Patient Hawk to be precise. Um, to get a nice little lieutenant specialist that will be a great upgrade for our roster and on top of it we can uh, counter show force all we need to do is destroying an alien relay that should not be the biggest problem we do have a bit of a mixed team because our prime team uh, is either in bond training or negative trait removal and i figured that uh, the mission is not difficult enough to really warn the prime team so might as well go in with a secondary team uh, this time, instead of going in with three Grenadiers, uh, we put a second uh, Ranger in here. It's a bit of a weird uh, bag because currently we're <clears throat> lacking uh, enough snipers. We only have two. Inappropriate Murphy it was injured from a covert ops mission and uh, our second sniper that we've just used on the Blackside facility is tired. So. We find ourselves in that weird spot where we really could use um, some more ranged DPS, but it is what it is. Um, you can, if you know what you're doing, you can almost play with any combination. It's just a matter of uh, piloting uh, the team well enough. Let's go, boys. All right, landed. Let's take a look at the map. Okay, we need to destroy that. This here is a train. Yeah, I know that map, it's a train and afterwards a relatively open area with most of the packs clustered uh, back there. Moving to position. The advantage and disadvantage of the train is the line of sight with the train is a bit funky. Good bastard. Can move all the way to there because there is an entrance door and the entrance door, despite how it looks like, actually is a full cover uh, type of door. Which means if you are standing behind it, you won't have line of sight unless you're opening the door. These guys are walking to the left. Okay. Would like to get Bester to there in due time. That's affirmative. Okay, that's relatively far away. Might as well do this. Good, opening the door, moving further in. Let's do this. Let's use the high ground. Got it, moving. Je confirme la position. Time to move. Good. a beefy pack but nothing that we could not handle closing on target position now Going to here let's get that lancer first Tail and rounds for the win. Good. Look, we're moving a bit further to the front. Taking out more of the cover. Good. 
good what else are we dealing with always when you do have extra action scout ahead two sectors is not a pack there must be something else either third sector or um, specter could go with them or viper But this time we do have death from above and this time this here works out well gotta watch our granite uh, um, utilization but getting two of them out of full cover is worth it in my perspective also it shred shredded the guy very well he's now poisoned makes it even more difficult for him to advance mm. not great Okay, time is of the essence. We definitely would want to push forward. Target disabled. Good. Difficult decision. This here is a great uh, angle, but we don't have a lot of time to make it work. That's my trigger. Okay, it was Spectre. Good, let's set these guys up for a nice killing spree. Yeah, should have pre hit the guy just so, but that wouldn't have happened. Spectre is vanishing to somewhere. Let's see if we can reveal the Spectre. Yes, we can. That's another huge advantage. Of using vision related uh, mm, vision related abilities such as the uh, beacon good get one more grenade going for us Plenty of time, so no rush. 
I saw a viper here, so there is definitely another pack. Next round is just going to be stabilizing here, killing the transmitter, reloading and so on and so forth. Good, let's use the shotgun because that's a really bad overwatch weapon. Menace one five, we've confirmed destruction of the relay. The alien transmission is down. Eliminate any remaining hostiles and move to evac. Whatever comes through here will get overwatched upon heavily. Good. Mech immediately down. That's another Spectre. Cool part about stocks is even if you miss, you'll you'll deal some damage. Alright. Not sure if this is the last pack. I want to be careful here. This is indestructible cover, so I think demolition will not work. But I am curious, so we're going to test it out. Does demolition work on these pillar, uh, pillars? No. It does not. We do have stocks, which isn't bad. Nice, fully dodged that one. And thankfully we got a stock over here, so that's two guaranteed damage, which means you are dead. Even if we would ha not have hit. And there's another pack. I already mentioned these guys tend to just cluster up like it's no, uh, no man's business. Shredding them, removing most of the cover. Very kill into full cover, right next to a snack. and gunning right next to you hi shotgun to the face seals the deal good we had I think four or five rounds left over when that uh, whole mission went down so yeah 
mentioned it's not going to be the most difficult one just really straightforward in and out threat assessment exactly what we want advanced perception great find And look at that, we got another great soldier here. He's gifted, so it does have uh, some extra some extra AP and I think this is even a new character. Oh yeah, Lance, welcome. Good to have you on board. Training center, Lance is using his own um, AP and I think we're going for scanning protocol or haywire. Haywire is great yeah let's go for haywire that'll come in handy later We can could use them, but at the moment I think we're just going to build the radio relay. Then we grab uh, the continent bonus here, and we're going to go into Europe. Great. Frost bomb. That's helpful. And that's blue screen rounds finally. Don't need psionics in this run. Could go for some extra intel. We could go for mimic beacons, which would be interesting as well. We could definitely go for some malarium, which is the um, preparation of weapon upgrades. I foresee a no Let's do that. From this could also do um, could also do mutants into grenade upgrade, but we already have a queue in the proving ground, so might as well just go for the obvious choice. Um, now that we do have blue screen rounds, uh, we ca uh, could build them. Wait a second, do we need to get blue screen protocol here? I could use the help. Yeah. We're ready to go, Commander. If you need a skull jack, we can build one at any time. Good. Need a core for that. Long live the resistance. Good, we now got voluntary army, we're back to 750 and we could make contact. So that's good. What do we need? Intel is fine. I'll tell you what, we're going to go for the alloys. Well, that's not bad. Getting some will help us uh, to upgrade further. We then of course need some malarium as well, but that's all good. I'll play that uh, off screen. Our people seem to work well together, Commander. All right, fantastic. We get another Reaper. after that last action together. They're coming to join up with you. Hope you don't mind. We've constructed the ring facility, Commander, but currently So, a couple of things here, right? Uh, so True Rebel got a promotion. Might as well let him and Van, uh, Vincent to be a team going forward. Sonar and True Rebel. Remote start. Yes, please. Shrapnel. Yes, please. Silent killer. Yes, please. And the final march for those humans deceived by the elders' false promises. In destroying it, we have Blood trail. Okay, cool.
Very nice. In terms of advanced perception, I think our sniper could use that as well. <clears throat> Good. We got also got negative trait removal done, which means next up more Stormwalker. Unfortunately, needs to remove uh, the negative traits. Uh, it is necessary. I don't want any of that. And Shadowkeeper. Four more days, yeah. We're we're doing fine. We're ready for that facility. And we need to get her soon. More likely to appear in combat, that is not a problem. And now we also got faces once. Again, not a problem. New re retaliation will happen very fast. Um, recruitment costs irrelevant. Irrelevant. The dark events are not a big problem. I am coming for you. The chosen haven't given up on finding us, Commander. One of them is closer than ever. My people are up for some additional work. If you've got any orders for us, Commander. We have learned new things. Good. Uh, we definitely need to do an, a new covert action mission. Breakthrough for improved magnetic weapons. Uh, that uh, is not great because we want improved plasma weapons. It's a fantastic breakthrough, don't get me wrong, but uh, not at the right time now. Uh, I think we need to get her. Anders is uh, there, and with Anders, 8.5 is there, reduces it by one day. And if we further reduce uh, the risk of anyone being wounded, that would be fine, because then afterwards we can immediately gi uh, give it a go. 15 days. We need to do the facility first. I don't think uh, that now is a good time. An extra scientist is great. Dodge, good as well. This one is bad. And this one, of course, is fantastic. It's question, do we want to do that uh, whilst we're waiting? You know what? Why not? Um, we can do it with anyone, which is really the fun part about that. So within those seven days, what I would want to do is get the shadow keeper and then attack the facility i think we're in a unique position to do that now uh, we'll interrupt the negative trait uh, recovery but that's not the end of the world we got everybody ready so the moment that that shadow keeper uh, comes online we're going to uh, we're going to go Good, I think we still can upgrade the Shadow Keeper. Gremlin Mark II isn't bad either, and the Axe. Shadow Keeper necessary, Axe is necessary, Gremlin Mark II is good. Tell me something, Doctor. Must have been pretty cushy working with Advent, living in the colonies. 
So why the sudden change of heart? Like most people, I wanted to believe that the aliens were legitimately interested in peace. Although they left me little choice when it came to working Good. with them. I admit... You should have known better. The aliens would never have come here if they wanted peace. As I said, it was a mistake. One I hope to atone for through my efforts with XCOM. Then I'd say you've got your work. Okay, let's take this mission on, and before we do that, free our uh, Templar, because we might need them. It would be great to have Banish already, that would make the whole fight against uh, the alien ruler much, much easier. I think we can still pull it off. Good. So a couple of things to begin with. For starters, we do have the spider suit. Good. Fantastic. Um, hmm. Let's take that one. We uh, the stock uh, helped us so often. Good tail and rounds, and we're having the iconic axe. But in the right hand, this thing should cut down any and we definitely need a frost bomb. So we're not going to use the frost bomb unless we're seeing uh, the uh, the viper, uh, the uh, king. Then what we're going to do is we're going to frost bomb him and shred him, and then hopefully that'll be enough to. Uh, and give him a run for his money. We're going to use uh, Stormwalker as a living mimic beacon. And we're going to go in with yet another mind shield. Okay. That'll be difficult to pull off flawlessly. Good. We are here, but we're not having high ground, which is something that I would like to have against the Viper King. No missed shots, if possible. Okay, there's the high ground we have been looking for. Very good. Move. 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 And move. Got it. Moving. Oh. And move, of course. Wait. Oh, we got one of these um, XCOM oper uh, XCOM resistance operatives with us. I just realized uh, that right here, Yong Sun Song. Difficult name. Moving as ordered. Okay, cool. Will do. Moving up. Inappropriate Murphy takes a nice little high ground. On the move. I see the 
Stonewalker. It would be hilarious if we can execute uh, them with a repeater. All of the preparation. And then they are just going to die with a repeater. <laughs> the ladder that way they can't move up here is going to be the Viper King. Everything else is, relatively speaking, not that difficult. These guys are trying their very best uh, to move up. I'm trying my very best to not let that happen by yet again blocking it. an overwatch. Double checking if we're running in. I want to make sure that we're not running into another pack. Believe this would be subject Gamma. Fallen created a Viper King. Just what we needed. Good. We at least know where the Viper King is at. Heading to that location. Overwatch, 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 overwatch. And next round we're engaging these two. Let's get the Mac. We're in their sight. getting us some focus and some loot apparently. Datapad, scope, not bad. We could use a little bit more than just the scope. Good copy. Moving on target. Oh wow, the Vi Viper King is so close. Good. Softening the guy up. Hit the armor. 
Good hit. Now they are standing right side by side, watching. My life is in your hands. No one will cross. Back into cover. And Overwatch. It's not yet. Oh no, he is triggered. All right, two overwatch shots for free. Okay, 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 hmm, how do we get uh, that one? I do have an idea. This should not trigger an action. But wait, if it does, hmm, we don't know. Um, hand over teamwork so that, that uh, the action is uh, stored. Shit. My bad. Very much frozen. This should not trigger because it can't see us. Good. This will remove cover and shred and then it's go time. Further shredding. Good. Now. This does not trigger. Unfortunately, we can't move forward. Currently out of line of sight, but moving there would definitely trigger. All right, threat assessment on to ghost. into overwatch, uh, not triggering because we're out of line of sight. Um, we're overwatching here, that's a free hit as well. That would trigger if we're doing something. And... We would get into his line of sight here, which would trigger. Amplify would trigger as well. That 
triggers at least Blade Storm. So there is another free Overwatch. There we go. And now I need a couple of good Overwatch shots. Does not trigger because free action and it will flee. Summons the gate. Which should trigger a blade storm again. Okay, and we almost got it. No blade storm. Okay, well, it's down to almost nothing. And all we had was a bit of frost breath. Not optimal, I made one mistake, one crucial mistake by giving over um, the ability points elsewise we could have uh, shredded her right away uh, shredded it right away I can see them flanking. I strike the darkness. I will what up Newton is down. I think the biggest threat is eliminated, luckily. to reload and refocus Cover me, I'm reloading. there might be one more pack Good. Uh, Overwatch. Reload. 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 Overwatch. And Overwatch. Let's hit the mutant and hit him hard. Okay, still more packs. You would have guessed by now that these guys are 
are more than okay to just leave it at that, but no, no such thing. Moving over, a bit of a weird combination here with uh, teamwork into flanking position, essentially a run and gun for the poor. Also didn't work out as expected. Good, 50-50. Good hit. Confirmed. Let's go into full cover. Target disabled. We still got a protocol. Uh, with a nice uh, mm, threat assessment putting it on the guy with the stock so that if we're missing we're still dealing damage there you go little trick to optimize the damage And Shadowbound. Great. Moving up. Getting that spectre nice and low. We could um, revive the protocol. This is what I would do if the spectre wouldn't already be de facto dead. I think we're through with it. No, there is still a turret or something. Good, doesn't matter. We got what we came for. S15, status confirmed. X4 charges are armed. Move to the extraction point for immediate evac. Get this done. Affirmativo. Okay. Go, go, go. Pulling back. I'm good. I'm going. Okay, I think we got it, uh, the Viper King down to about 20 hit points maybe less than that yeah it was one turret good that'll stop the whole um, process for six weeks and also reduces the avatar project by three. Best stay on our toes. It could show up again at any time. With the alien facility destroyed, 
their efforts to develop the Avatar project will likely suffer a substantial decline, at least for the time being. Excellent work, Commander. Good. We could we do have enough intel to expand, but not greatly expand. Next target will be Europe. Next target will be Europe. So, buckle up, Buttercup. That's where we are going. But before that happens, are we are yet again uh, attacked. But that happens next time. I think we're taking most of the A team. Once the Templar is tired, then we're removing uh, the uh, negative trait because tired. Uh, mm, if you're removing negative traits or bonding, the tired will go away afterwards, which is fun because that effectively saves your time. Little optimizations like that on the strategy layer will help you to become better. Okay, so next up, shielded power coil. Uh, likely are going to decrypt the decipher protocol after Elarium. Uh, that will give us the option to build. Nah, we need to first of all school check. Uh, the codex then we need to um, decrypt the codex brain oh no no no, no. we uh, the enemy Our protocal alien encryption uh, should give us uh, the shadow chamber I want to build that here on the shielded power coil to make it very energy efficient um, after Ilarium, we also get the best tier of weapons, so might as well use that to our advantage. And other than that, things are actually looking very, very well for us. Uh, the Prime Team is coming together nicely, already got Bond level 3, got a couple of Bond level 2s. Might want to uh, Bond inappropriate Murphy and Stormwalker, that way we do have a full uh, set of um, uh, a full set of uh, high level soldiers that can work together and even the second team looks fine we got sergeants couple of lieutenants so easy we can work with that we can work with that which brings us to the end of today's episode if you enjoyed uh, the content then leave a comment and a like down below I know I'm saying that often but only two or three people typically do it so maybe we can get like 20 uh, for once and see you in the next episode. Bye bye.